Welcome back to SoFi Stadium, the host of today's divisional round matchup between the New York Giants and the Los Angeles Rams. New York is led by rookie quarterback out of Texas, Willie Beeman, who took over for Daniel Jones, who was out with a concussion. While Jones was out, Willie posted eight total touchdowns through three games he ended the regular season for them, which was enough for coach Joe Judge to ride the high hand of Willie Beeman into the playoffs. In Willie's playoff debut, he threw for over 300 yards and added three touchdowns through the air. Did come with two interceptions though, as they beat 40, the 49ers 28-13. to Willie Beeman was enough of a spark to drag the Giants into the playoffs at 9-7, going 2-1 in his game starting for them, and did enough for them to get their first playoff win in years. But will he be able to keep up the spark, keep the flame going in today's, today's game versus another hot shot rookie? Speaking of the hot shot rookie, Los Angeles dominated on all phases in the wild card last week, pitching a shutout against the Washington football team. Matthew Springs put up four total touchdowns with zero turnovers compared to Willie's two turnovers. And there's nothing much to say about that besides if Los Angeles can perform half as well as they did last week, they have a shot at making a return to the NFC Championship. But that is going to do it for your pregame show presented to you by Young Foxboy himself. Let's jump right into the game. Battle of the Rookies in the divisional round but you know what we're gonna start it off just like we did last time we're gonna start quick we're gonna start fast we're gonna get matthew springs comfortable let's do it dropping back gonna try to get loose tries to throw it away get sacked second and 19 after the sack let's see if we can get our boy open drop back we got steven sims wide open big game he might get the first force he gets mighty close let's go come on let's get the rhythm going let's get this first Bijan, i'm gonna need you to get in there for me Bijan, i'm gonna need you to get in there for me and we're stuffed in the backfield because somebody missed a block and we got a punt oh my gosh they saw it coming and the punt is oh that looked like it was going to be blocked all right now on trout our rookie competitor Willie Beeman making his second start in the playoffs draws it back look for a man pressure in his face throws it over the middle he has number 17 who is that is that DJ Chark they run no huddle looks like they got the scheme that we tried to get going going that was DJ Chark for 13 Beeman making some adjustments thinks he sees something he likes a snap Looking for a man. He's going to try to take off. He has room. He's getting loose. He gets a first down. The Giants offense coming out moving. They got a tempo going. Beeman not doing, not letting the defense get a breather. We need an Aaron Donald sighting. We need an Aaron Donald sighting. Almost gets a sighting as Beeman overthrows Evan Ingram. First incompletion of the day. Let's go. Come on, defense. First to force to stop. We're going we're gonna to score. We're going to score. Looks like Ramsey is on DJ Chark. Got to watch that matchup right there. As Beeman takes the snap. No pressure. Tries to go at the middle. Aaron Donald forces a fumble. But the lineman picks it up. And he gains about two yards. Aaron Donald strip sack. Let's go. Third and 12. Here they go. They keep coming out with empty. Nobody in the backfield. That is not what you want to do against Aaron Donald leaving him one-on-one -on -one. they got to be double teaming him every play they have to double team him every play as Willie Beeman is going to try to convert this third and 12 long ways to go offensive line stole one of the guys he's going to try to get loose nobody there are they going to stop him before he gets the first no he gets blasted by Jalen Ramsey he holds on to the ball no pass rush no contain whatsoever and he gets to the 41 Beeman got help in the backfield now back-to-back -back plays Barkley in the backfield doubles to the left evan ingram in the slot to the right as he drops back the blitz coming through aaron donald gets another sack let's go another third and long can we get pressure again on third and 18 don't let him scramble for this we gotta run contain here third and 18 will the defense come up clutch for us they run a read option on third and 18 and that's shut down they're gonna have to send this back to us let's go defense forced a turnover for us so let's go uh well they forced a stop so now we're back where we started let's get some points gonna try to hand it off to cam Akers. let's see if he can get loose for us cam Akers still forms up in gets nine yards let's go we got to get the traditional run game popping third and one needing only a yard 
We're going to make a quick adjustment. Snap. Looking for a man. Steven Sims wide open. Will he hang on to it? Yes, sir. Gets us a first. He's going to send Robert Woods in motion. Fake to him. Fake to that guy. And we got a tight end. Wide open. Been, and he mosses who is that is that tyler higby moss number 33 yes sir third and 10 if anybody's able to convert these it's matthew springs empty backfield we're gonna need a little bit of time on this one snap they send blitz we have a wide open hole matthew springs gonna truck him in and get that for us get you a quarterback with some grit that's gonna do that for you yes sir let's go they're showing blitz they don't send it. Matthew Springs dot Bryce Hopkins. Let's go right in the corner. Gets us to the one yard line. Matthew Springs is going to make a quick adjustment. See if he can pick this up. Snap throw wide open. Steven Sims gets the touchdown. And we take a lead right here, right now. The blitz was a little too obvious. Matthew Springs studies, man. Matthew Springs studies. Let's go. Come on. Matthew Springs has been near perfect in the two minute drill this season so you a three here would be great for the defense but evan ingram is not covered by anybody probably going to see a quick throw to him honestly as they go <laughs> we are sending this stuff again willie beeman in the backfield the defense comes up clutch and they kick a three let's go they run a fake they run a fake and it's stuffed let's go they should have took the points we got to make them pay for this second and three in the pistol got an h back Dropping back. Has Cooper Cup on the sideline. He makes that catch for us. Let's go. Dot up. First and 10. Come on, let's keep it rolling. Gonna go play action. Rolling out. Can we make that throw? And it's broken up by number 21. Second and 10. Nerves rattling. Springs sends a man in motion. Robert Woods. Gonna be a fake. They send blitz. We got a man. Steven Sims wide open up the sideline. But he couldn't keep his feet. Let's go. Gonna try to get the run game popping. Don't want to score too quick here. Don't want to score too quick here. Gonna go counter. They miss a block and that has blown up by 59. How do they miss Lorenzo Carter? All right, we got a task here. Gotta come. Gotta convert second and 15. It's okay. We just gotta make third down easy for us snap looking for a man we have cooper cup wide open and one on one and he makes the catch cooper cup one second and 15 makes a big play for us cooper let's go one on one don't do that don't do that don't leave that man one on one he makes plays don't leave that man one on one he makes plays we're sending a man in motion once again snap fake fake no one open matthew springs gonna run looking for a man he's gonna slide oh gotta be careful maddie third and four this is a bigger down as any want to get points here snap looking for a man running for his life has a lane can he make that throw tyler higby on the reroute let's go matthew springs creating time gets the touchdown let's go come on Let's go. This is why you start Matthew Springs. I told you he's been prolific when it comes to this. He's prolific when it comes to the two minute drill. Now they have to hurry up. Now they have to hurry up. The pressure is being felt third and short. They've been converting a lot of these over the middle. Watch out for Evan Ingram. You see him in the slot at the bottom of your screen does a fake hike. Evan Ingram on the drag. He's going to throw it to him. We said, look out for that man. Tried to cover him with a pass rusher. Not a very smart idea. Should have been playing inside inside leverage right there. I don't know why they're showing a replay for a drag route, but hey, here we go. First and 10, Willie Beeman, not a bad day. They just haven't been able to finish the drives. Starting at its own 47, gonna go another read option. He keeps this one, gonna get loose with the legs. Great block by Evan Ingram, tries to outrun him in 28. Sheffield drags him down. Willie Beeman out, right, out rushing Saquon Barkley. Gotta get Barkley rolling got some playmakers on this offense but here's the thing their problem has not been moving the ball it's been getting it in the end zone as they hand it off to saquon again gets a decent chunk that second effort might get him six he was hit up after five second and four had they not ran the fake field goal it would be six to 14 right now 
when they're back nearing red zone territory again they're gonna go play action willie beeman clean pocket loads one up to evan ingram over the middle once again if it ain't broke don't fix it here we go trips bunch to the top of your screen dj chart the lone receiver to the bottom saquon barkley in the backfield willie beeman dropping back samson ebucon coming in hot he's gonna dump it off to harris he reaches for a first down gets loose on Jalen Ramsey of all things the bunch formation creates some separation for Harris on his third catch of the day Jalen Ramsey two tackles have been pretty much locked down all day Willie Beeman in the red zone once again but can he get points out of it they go with I don't know what kind of play that was but it ends up in the hands of Saquon and he turns nothing into something second and eight 11 yards away from making this a game Willie Beeman trips to the left the tops of your screen watch out for Evan Ingram Willie Beam is sitting in the pocket. Loads one up for Evan Ingram. He mosses a man. Stiff arms him. He runs it to the end zone. Evan Ingram, the X Factor today. Good coverage that time. It's just we knew he was going over the middle. We just could not stop it. And Willie Beeman gets on the board. Oh, my goodness. Sheffield should have played the ball and got an interception there. But Evan Ingram just makes a, a clutch play. All right, Willie Beeman and the Giants put points on the board. We just got to keep doing our thing giving him less time to do it and you know just make sure he can't keep up run the read option here we're gonna try to get loose on this safety can we stiff arm him no he drags us down third and five snap looking for a man throws a quick one and it's intercepted number 25 patrick peterson cooper cup ran the route a little too deep there little too deep there that's Matthew Spring's first interception in a while. So Willie Beeman has a shot to take a lead here. Comes out under center for the first time. Most is a man. Hand off the Saquon. And he is stuffed after a gain of about one or two. Willie Beeman making some adjustments. Probably going to try to look for Evan Ingram over the middle. Drops it back. Evan Ingram on the out. And he is wide open with a blocker. Shedding tackles. Evan Ingram, the monster today. The Giants probably just going to try to run this right up the gut. You have Saquon Barkley. A top, t a top two <laughs> running back in the league. Right here. Let's see what we can get. They make an adjustment here. Thinks he sees something he likes. Tries to run a counter. And that is stuffed, actually. Stuffed right on the goal line. They're going to have to take some more time to do this. To pull this off. Here we go. Flip field. Second and goal from the one. Defense is going to have to pull out a miracle here. They go fullback dive. And that is the easiest touchdown of number 39's life. And they take their first lead of the day. Here we go. First and 10 after the turnover. Gets rid of our lead. We go play action. Looking for a man. Throws that wide open. Steven Sims breaks a tackle. Can he get a block? Tries to juke a man. Nice play right there. Nice threat in the needle by Matthew Springs. Gonna go hurry up. Let's see if he sees something that he likes. Just back. Looking for a man. Has Cooper Cup. And he makes that catch on the sideline. Moving the field quickly. 39. Matthew Springs needing to make a play. They send Blitz again. Gonna throw it to Steven Sims. And that has to be pass interference. That has to be pass interference. Let's go. Giants showing Blitz. Snap. They send Blitz. We're running for our life. Has a man open. Will he get in the end zone though? No, he will not. Tried and true. Can Matthew Springs sneak it in here? Let's see. Snaps it. And he's in. Matthew Springs with a rushing touchdown. Not as pretty as the other ones. But he takes this lead back after a quick drive. Let's go. They go up by four. Once again, Willie Beeman is going to have to do it again. Willie Beeman has been putting on a show here. But can he keep up with Matthew Springs? He's going to need an 80-yard drive here. But you don't want to leave Matthew Springs too much time to come back and answer. Because he's been clutch. Out and empty. The defense needs to force a stop. They got two stops to start the game. But can they get one more? to give Matthew Spree Samson have you come forcing a bad throw let's go Samson defense needs to make two more plays two more plays coming out and empty can we see another Aaron Donald sighting haven't seen him since the first quarter second and ten Evan Ingram in the slot look for him to run a drag here Willie Beeman barking out some orders here they need a turnover a turnover would be huge dropping back Pressure getting close to him. He loads one up deep. It is. Oh, Jalen Ramsey nearly had his hands on one. One more play defense. One more play. Here we go. Will a drag route be enough to get this first down? 
trips to the top of the screen. Willie Beeman needs to make something happen. They're putting the ball in his hands. Here we go. Makes an adjustment to Evan Ingram. Probably going to be on a slant. Something over the middle for Ingram. It has to be. The defense needs to force a stop here. Snap. Looking for a man. Pressure coming. He gets hit as he throws. And it's broken up. Evan Ingram cannot make the play. Let's go. Defense gets a stop. We have to get three minimum here. We have to get three minimum here. Let's try to get the run game brewing. Cam Akers runs right up the gut and gets us a decent bit. He gets us a decent bit. I like that. Here we go. Second and five. Need to get in field goal range and milk clock while doing it. Snap. We get to pull this one. Nice block, Cooper. Nice block. Slide. Let's go. Let's milk some more clock. I'd say 10, 20 yards away from field goal range. Snap. They back out of blitz. We're running. Spivy makes plays for us. Let's go. He gets a first down, but he steps out. It's okay. Good job, Spivy. Fourth and one. Huge play. Coach giving me an option here to go for it. Let's do it. Let's do it. And let's milk some clock. Huge play. Play of the game right here. Let's go. Snap. Looking for a man. Steven Sims. Wide open. He hangs onto it. Let's go. Let's go. Steven Sims. Here we go. Second and seven. We're going to take a quick shot. Snap. They send blitz. We got a man. Wide open. Robert Woods. And he makes the catch. Let's go. That makes this insurmountable. He can make it pretty, but that makes it insurmountable. Let's go, Booth Review. It was so nice. They want to see it twice. It was so nice. And it's uphill. Let's go. Matthew Springs with a beautiful, perfectly located ball. They take they gave it us an option to go for it on fourth it down. Matthew Springs throws the dot to Steven Sims. Then we come out. Coach McVay calls the shot play. Matthew Springs puts it right on the money. Right on the money, middle of the end zone, right on the sideline, makes the toe drag swag. Come on, come on. What a game. What a game. But it's still not over. They have all three timeouts. Let's see what Willie Beeman can do. Went three and out last time they were on the field, looking to rewrite the script here and try to get back into this game. Looking for his favorite man, but he was double. Those went up deep, and it is knocked away by Kendall Sheffield. Let's go. Sterling Shepard cannot moss us. Young Giants team, young quarterback, but you got to know you can't get it all in one play. You need to hit chunks, but you don't need to get the big ones. Pressure in his face, and he gets sacked by Aaron Donald. Let's go. Get an Aaron Donald sighting. Third and 14. Rams showing blitz. This is going to be a tough series for him. 10 seconds on the play clock. Snap. They're coming at him. He throws one over the middle. Wide open is Evan Ingram. And he gets kind of loose with that one. They need to run hurry up here. They don't have the luxury to milk a timeout. They got to snap this quick. Quick adjustment to Evan Ingram. Uh, Billy Beeman drops back, throws one to Evan Ingram, and he drops it. He's been making tough catches all day, but he drops that one. But on the bright side, he does stop the clock. It stops the clock. They get the regroup, call a different formation. Here we go. Evan Ingram in the slot. Once again, trips to the top of the screen. Willie Beeman, pressure coming at him. Throws one. Evan Ingram over the middle once again. Just a favorite target today. That has to be a Giants record. He has to have 10 or so catches. Honestly, barks out another adjustment to him. Willie Beeman looking quick, but his man is doubled. Still throws it to him. And every Ingram still makes the catch. But they don't have enough. Oh, 15 seconds left. Let's go. They can only make it look pretty. Let's go. I accidentally punched my headset off my face. Oh, my goodness. Willie Beeman dropping back, looking to make it pretty. Tries to get loose. And he gets sacked. Aaron Donald. Fourth sack of the day. We get an Aaron Donald sighting in the fourth quarter. And it looks like they're not going to call a timeout. And that's going to do it. We're going to the NFC Championship. It was a great game by Willie Beeman. But he could not keep up with the sheer firepower of the Rams offense led by Matthew Springs. Perfect balls. Just great throws all over the place. Let's go. Let's go the defense comes out clutch for us we needed to stop they got one for us and then they made it to where it was too long for him to get down there let's fucking go come on 28 to 17 they got a takeaway but it wasn't enough 
shout out to the bin but don't break defense you see that man in the top right corner shout out to apollo bro apollo and filter link will definitely be in the description of this one because he's in the video he'll definitely be in the description of this one go check that man out you can go see the game from his perspective or you can just go see his other content he has a podcast out very dope very dope podcast they you know hey they talk about football stuff every now and again he has his own next gen series he has two of them uh he has a cornerback a wide receiver and hopefully he's not too salty to post this one even if he is you know i'm gonna post it big respect he came out here and did his thing although it was not enough he had 22 for 30 276 73 per completion percentage matthew spring he had more yards than us actually but we added three touchdowns in the air and we had the the court qb sneak in 34 on the ground all right shout out to the boy hey texas out of texas yeah hey but anyways hey ain't nothing left to say besides envy no man because we know we up next sponsored by atari and